Welcome to the Scarabies channel, my dear craftswomen. I am Galina Chiromissina, and today with you we are going to weave four leaf bracelet according to the pattern from our partner and designer, Anna Dubinina. Also, today you have a chance to get $30 coupon in our shop scarabies.com. More information in the end of the video. In the second part of the video, you will see how to beat earrings in order to get a set. For this project, we will need Fire line of the dark color, a thick thread, seed beads, size 10 and 11, triangle beads. Kelps Papuka. It is possible to use flat, regular ones, but today I have chosen volumetric pyramids Super Kelps Papuka. These beads are interchangeable, the same size, they have two holes on the base and by one hole on the sides. Tube shade beads minus papuka, they look spectacular in the 4 bead cross. Faceted beads 4 mm diameter, findings, clasp, two jump rings and head pin for the pendant, needle, scissors and chain nose pliers. All materials you can purchase on the scarabids.com. Let's take cut of fire line around 2 meters. We will work with both ends in rotation. Take a triangle curbs papuka. This bead has two holes in the base. Place the bead base upwards and go with the needle through the left hole from the side towards the base. String the combination. Seed bead size 11, minus bead, seed bead size 11, and go through the second base hole of the same triangle. String. Seed bead size 10 and the next triangle in the same manner, from the side hole towards the base. And again, the same combination, seed bead size 11, minus, seed bead size 11, and return to the second hole. In the same way, we string for the element 4 triangles. After we strong the last seed bead size 10, go once more through the left hole of the first triangle in order to close the element. Now we are going to do the second circle and add decorations with faceted beads. Go once more through seed bead, minus bead and seed bead. and string the combination, seed bead size 11, faceted bead, seed bead size 11. Go through the whole combination above the next triangle, seed bead, minus bead, seed bead. String, seed bead, faceted bead, seed bead. And again the same, close the circle and first unit of our bracelet is ready. Transfer between the elements we will do through four minus beads shaped like a cross. Going out from the nearest minus bead, string three more minus papuka beads and close them into the ring, going through the first one in the same direction. Such an elegant diamond. Tight everything accurately and straighten the weaving. Start the second element. Go through minus diamond in such way so that the thread will go out of the opposite minus bead. That bead will be a part of the second element. String seed bead size 11 and triangle curves papuka through the left base hole. Then we continue to weave the element as usual. Seed bead size 10, next keops from the left side hole towards the base.
combination seed bead size 11 minus seed bead size 11 go through second hole of the curves seed bead size 10 and with string like that 4 triangles. Now close the element, string seed bead size 10 and go through the first triangle into the side hole. Add seed bead size 11 and go through minus. The element is closed. Now we are just passing through the beads till the next triangle, adjust the tension of the thread, go through seed bead minus seed bead combination and add the second row with faceted beads. String seed bead size 11, faceted bead, string bead size 11, and again go through the combination above the next curves bead. Surround the whole element, pass towards the minus, and weave the next transfer. In the same manner, we do required number of elements. When the thread will be used, you can continue to weave symmetrically with the second end of the file line we have left in the beginning. Like that, I have made 8 elements. On the last element, we need to do a loop from beads for findings. When you start weaving with the second end of file line, diamond transition weave as usual, but the second end of the tree should go out from minus to the right. We weave the element with the left end of the tree counterclockwise, string seed beads and curves papuka triangles through the right hole of base. With the second triangle, we pick up standard combination. Seed bead minus seed bead. With third triangle, the most extreme one in our bracelet, string 5 seed beads. After that, we finalize the element as usual. First triangle, seed bead and close the unit. Let's control our four leaf. The seed bead loop should be located against the transfer. At the second row with faceted beads as usual, go through the loop for findings once more. We have completed our weaving. Fix the treat with couple of knots. Hide them between seed beads. Cut off the treat in a taut state. At one end of the bracelet, fix jump ring with clasp.
At another end of the bracelet, fix ring and add a small pendant, head pin with faceted bead and seed bead. Such pendant is very convenient to hold while fastening the bracelet. The bracelet fall leaf is ready. Try to do it yourself. Combine new colors. Create new jewelry set using the same technique. My variant of beaded earrings is shown in the second part of the video. Choose new beautiful beads in our shop skyrobies.com and see you soon again on our channel. To get $30 coupon, just subscribe to our channel, like the video and leave a comment. We'll pick up a random winner in two weeks. Check our next video to see if you are lucky.